Hey everybody, so if you were bored last night, you could have swung over to the Glarer's channel and watched him and his subs, watch Dolly and his subs, watch Cinema Shogun's video while Dolly roasted him. I would show a clip of it, but then we would just be adding another layer of people watching people watching people, so I'm not going to do that. I will say if you stuck around the Glarer's channel for a bit longer, you would have gone on to see later on in that uh, stream, where the glare is now critiquing um molly golightly's clothing i really didn't know that he was that interested in women's clothing so it seemed a little off but hey it is the glare another thing is that i've noticed some in some of my comments um people keep talking about that my comments on cinema shogun's video as if it had something to do with dolly just because the topic was about Dolly doesn't mean that what I was saying was in defense of Dolly. What I was saying is that Cinema Shogun had incorrect information. And then when he was corrected about it in his own chat or is in, in his own channel, he was abrasive to his own subs. And he also was using Dolly Vision's brother's criminal history as some sort of reason which made no sense to me because i don't understand what that has to do with it so there was that dolly is a growing up he can take care of himself he doesn't need me as his mouthpiece that is for sure um he has no problem speaking his mind and i believe that that's what he was doing when he was making that video um the one that the glare was watching and I don't know about everybody else, but I am so tired of hearing about Dolly Vision's brother. So tired of it. I've gotten to the point where I do not give a fiddler's fart. I don't come to YouTube to just specifically hear on every single place I go all about Dolly Vision's brother. I think we get the point now. I do believe that everybody is fully aware. It doesn't need to be hammered into my forehead. Like, you know, it's just too much. Enough is enough. The last thing I wanted to talk about right now is Cher. Cher does not seem to be giving Billy Joe Howell, her best friend and family member, close family member, as much attention as she had been um, for the last few months. She said that she was going to be there all the way for Billy Joe throughout this process. And I don't think that she is. And I believe that this is the beginning of Cher's discard. She's moving on to something that more people are talking about. One thing I will say is that Queen B and her panel and her chat members were there for Billy Joe last night and they were giving her comfort and solace and walking her through um, this grief process that she's going through. Um, and then they took it, I don't know if they took it offline or if they took it behind a paywall so that the world cannot keep coming by and rubbernecking Billy Joe uh, falling apart. And so I think that was good. I think that anybody that's reaching out and helping someone who is in need is doing a good thing. And so I actually think that was a great thing to do. Um, but Cher, where are you? You were walking this walk with her. Why aren't you still there? That's not right. That ain't right at all. You're she's supposed to be your friend. You're supposed to be there for her. But you seem to be moving on. And that friends don't do that. So anyways, that's all I really have to say today. My son and my daughter are coming over today. And um, I don't think I'll be back for a while. And I'll see you on these YouTube streets.